Hello YouTube, Dr. Sola coming to you from Lagos, Nigeria. Um, well, I promised you I'll give you an update on the forklift batteries and here they are. I've spent quite a bit of money running a generator. I've spent about the equivalent of a hundred thousand naira, which in dollars is not much, it's a little over three hundred dollars. And yeah, about a hundred about a hundred dollars. And I did not get these to work. Um, there are some cells, these are at zero, and then a bunch are under two volts. So what I'll do is I'll convert this to a 20 volt, 24 volt battery, and then get a 24 volt inverter, and then power my 24 volt loads off that. So I, I have a 24 volt inverter in my immediate future. Actually, I have a couple. Let me see if I can uh, rescue them, and then convert this to 24 volts and power the house of a 24 volt system it was good while it lasted but you know what i'm done way too much effort lost too much sleep lost too much power dealt with way too much noise and you know the reasons why you don't like lead acid batteries still apply so um i declared this a huge fail and an expenditure that i really well, I mean, it was an ex a worthy experiment, but I'm not going to do this again. I mean, I'm going back to my lithiums. By tomorrow, the lithiums will be back on. I ordered the new BMS. Once it arrives, we'll put the lithium-ion batteries. And then I got Delhi Green Balances. Once we put those on, I'll do a new video. I have something to show you. Let me go inside, and I'll show you in a second. As you can see, it's a very rainy day, very cloudy. So production was very poor. Ran this generator till it decided it was going to die. And then now I have no power. I have, I have power, but very limited power. So I'm going to go inside and show you. Hey, YouTube, I'm back. So as you can see, Growat has sent us a replacement inverter. And the form, well, it looks cute. I don't know. Other, yeah, it looks cute. I like the looks. Um, a lot of things you can program onto it. You can prioritize solar. You can prioritize grid and um, you can choose to have solar share the load with the grid depending on what resource you have available so right now i have 600 watts um, connected into it the battery is down to 42 volts which is those batteries outside and then i'm running off the victron because victron can go as low as 37.8 volts which i now see sometime tonight I have 2,000 watts on this, and I have 900 watts on this one. Okay, as you can see, the input voltage is much higher, 103 volts versus, um, I think, 90 or 60 volts we are seeing before. So tomorrow, I'll bring back my lithium-ion batteries, I'll put them here. I'll be able to run them to close to full charge and then with the Delhi Green balances I can balance and equalize. I'm pretty excited about that. Uh, once we get those in, we'll do another video to share with you. If you like what you see, give me a thumbs up. Once again, this is Dr. Sola coming to you from Lagos, Nigeria on a very cloudy and rainy day.